it's Alex and welcome to Hey Little Thrifter. I'm back with another Nightmare Queens video and today I'm going to be talking about Skin by Kathy Koja. Skin by Kathy Koja was published by Dell in 1994 and this is the third novel of hers that I've read. I have rated The Cipher, Bad Brains and Skin five stars each. They have all been astounding reads and she has definitely become one of my favourite authors of all time. Skin is about Tess. She is a sculptor, she works with metal, and she learned how to weld, even though it's a very male-dominated field and she was never taken seriously, but she persevered, learned the skills, and she spends quite a solitary life at the moment living above a shop where she works on her art. Her art is her passion and she puts her heart and soul into everything she does. One day, through a chance meeting, she meets a dancer called Bibi, and Bibi is fascinated by Tessa's art and encourages her to come watch her and her dance troupe perform. Bibi and her dancer friends perform this raw, animalistic, primal dance for Tess, who is probably a bit taken aback but Bibi is a really interesting person and quite persuasive and she speaks with Tess about them joining forces and performing something completely new and incorporating her sculptures into their performance. So they all work and work and they have their first performance together as the surgeons of the demolition. After their first performance, word really gets around and they're kind of a hot new thing in the underground art scene and they continue to perform but BB has her own ideas of where she wants the group to go and Tess isn't quite aligned with the same interests and they have a really intense relationship which goes from the good kind of intense to the bad kind of intense and their relationship starts to deteriorate as does the rest of the group. So I won't say too much more about the storyline but this was an incredible read. Her writing really is in a league of its own. It is beautiful and poetic and also raw and edgy all at the same time. It is visceral and shocking and it was surprisingly emotional too. I really felt for these characters and I think Kathy Koja does a great job with her characters in making them realistic and believable. One of the big elements of the story is about transformation and transcendence which are themes of the cipher and bad brains too but this is definitely in its own unique way. It's an excellent combination of psychological horror and body horror. A lot of the content is to do with body modification, like piercing, cutting and scarification. Her writing is really evocative. There are some really strong visuals in here and also a lot of really strong feelings. A lot of the story is about friendship, relationships, sexuality and I thought all of that was incredibly well done and yeah really made me feel for the characters. I'll read you a small portion just so you can get an idea of her writing if you've never read anything by her. This is at their first performance. Heat and steam, wet smoke above their milling heads. They were eyes, eyes, mouths already yelling, hands already overhead. The room filled in minutes, and there was still more, pushing underfoot in the soundless whoop of strobes, painful screeching of miked metal twisting slowly past tolerance, 
long combat legs striped in black and chrome silver, leaping incredible to a soundtrack noise so dense it was blood music, terror and strange comfort, consuming and consummation all in one. Yeah, this is an intense read in many ways. I absolutely loved it. I rated it 5 out of 5 stars and I highly recommend you pick it up and give it a read if you haven't before. So that was my review of Skin by Kathy Koja. Let me know if you've read this one. I'd love to hear your thoughts. Thank you ever so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it and hopefully I will see you again in my next video. Bye!